Hey you guys, thank you for watching MRTV. I am Maria and today, guys, we are making s'mores pie. Yes, we're making s'mores pie. Now, I seen this recipe when I was watching the Tipsy Bartender, okay? And I'm not even a fan of marshmallows, but it's something about when he make a recipe, it just, it looks so good. So I said I wanted to try it. So he said you needed the jumbo, okay? You need the jumbo <laughs> extra large marshmallows, okay? So I got that. Now he had the mini graham cracker crust, but the store I went to didn't have any, so we're working with this. All right, and see how that goes. I hope it doesn't mess it up because it wasn't the mini uh, crust. And of course, you're gonna need your Hershey's chocolate. Oh yeah, Hershey's chocolate. Okay, so let me go. I'm gonna open a bag of marshmallows and get the this off, open up the candy, all that good stuff. I'll be back. All right, so we are back. So I have my crust here. I broke up three of the Hershey's uh, bars and put it there. This one I'm gonna put back in the refrigerator and I'm gonna um, put it on top once it come out the oven. So I'm gonna line these up the best way I can to cover the bottom of the pie. Now he didn't put his chocolates in any particular type of way, but I know I'm gonna want as much covered as possible, so. <laughs> I hope I'm not going too crazy with the chocolate, but you know. You wanna make sure it's chocolate everywhere. So I'm gonna try to, and I know it's gonna melt, but I gotta use it anyway. Alrighty, now he didn't, I didn't hear what he mentioned what to put the oven on. So I have my oven on 350 and I'm just gonna let it stay there and just keep my eye on him, you know. So he says you wanna put your marshmallows on. And since he had individual ones, all he did was stick one marshmallow right on top of that one. So ooh, I hope I don't over marshmallow. That's not even a thing. <laughs> I just made a thing. So how about that? That looks like pretty much enough. Wait, let me get one more. I think I can squeeze one more in here. There you go. Now, that looks like that's going to be fine. <laughs> so I'm going to stick this in the oven. And I don't know how long it's gonna take, so I'm just gonna keep an eye on it. But you know when I come back, I'll let you know just how long it took. Okay guys, they were in, well the pie was in the oven for 10 minutes, exactly. And that's what we got at 10 minutes. See here, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm -hmm. Trying to see how I want to split the candy up so it can be even. Mm -hmm. So what he did next was he took a knife and he just kind of poked a little hole in there and then he set the candy in there. That was it. <laughs> Maybe that might have been a little too much in that one. Um, let's see. The chocolate is melted at the bottom. I don't know if you can see it right up in here. I'll give you a close up in just a minute. I 
broke that one open too much right there. So, let me get these last two. Well, this one's gonna get a big one. This one's gonna get a little one. We're just gonna set this back in the oven. But I don't know if you can see the chocolate down up in there and melt it. See that? Oh yeah. So we're gonna put these back in the oven. I don't know how long. I'll let you know when I get back. Okay, everybody, here we go. I put it back in the oven. Five more minutes, and this is what we got. Now, I guess if you want them darker or what have you, you can put them back in there, but it's pretty firm on top, and I didn't want to, you know, lose the little bite they have in them. So I'm going to let it rest, I don't know, maybe five or ten minutes. Then we'll see if I can actually cut it when we get back. Be back. All right, so it's been about five minutes. I'm nervous. I don't really know how to cut it. <laughs> Can I really cut it? <laughs> the shell don't hold. I don't think the crust is gonna hold. Ooh, that looks good. Look at me actually trying to cut it like a piece of pie. I think that's the best I'm gonna do with this knot. Hold on. job done. All right. Let us taste. Oh wait, I ain't even show you this. Well, look at what it's doing over there. <laughs> Getting this hang on. If you like s'mores, I truly believe you'll like this. So we can get a close up on it. That chocolate I put on the, the crust and what I melted down in those marshmallows. Oh my God. This is actually good. So you all should definitely check out the tipsy bartender for one he has some awesome um recipes food recipes drink recipes facebook just put in tipsy bartender and i want to thank everyone for watching and if this is your first time watching mrtv consider subscribing then hit that notification bell for upcoming videos give this one a thumbs up and i'll see you on the next video Peace.